now to education. Vice President Yemio Shimbajo said there is an urgent need for the review of the West African Secondary School Certificate Examination Curriculum. He said the review has become necessary in view of the current global development developmental challenges. Oshimbaje said this while declaring open the 70th annual council meeting of the West African Examinations Council, WIAC, yesterday in Abuja. He urged the examination body to adopt the teaching and learning methods of Cambridge International General Certificate of Secondary Education. It's now time to begin to prepare for the next 70 years. And it is clear that these coming decades will come with vastly different challenges and opportunities. There are at least three issues that present new challenges and, of course, opportunities. The first is the African continental free trade area and its implications for the growth of institutions. The second is the wire curriculum, teaching and examinations relevant to 21st century needs. And the third issue is the role of technology in the work of WIAC. These are essential skills that young people need today to be competitive and to be prepared for life and work in the global economy. So it seems to me that in the next few years, WIAC's curriculum and examinations and the teaching must be designed to test for and support these core skills. And of course, with the successes that WIAC has experienced, that has uh, demonstrated in the past 70 years, they are, they are adapting to these, uh, new ways and these new ways of thinking. Shouldn't present any problem at all. This is the Africa that WIAC must prepare our children for. An Africa that will need world-class young people who have strong interpersonal, innovative, entrepreneurial, critical, and creative thinking skills amongst others. I think it's also crucial that WIAC must continually embrace technology. And there is no option today. And we must commend WIAC again for the technological innovations that have been implemented so far, which includes biometric verifications, online registration, computer-based tests, and of course, uh, the digital certification 